Back straight and eyes front, lads. Now, before I carry out today's inspection, field command would like to know how a pair of rippers got into the marshal's personal latrine. Since I know for a fact that you are the only idiot stupid enough to do this without any thought of repercussions, I'm looking at you first. In addition to this, why have our trenches been dug in a quadrilateral? You were supposed to connect with the neighboring trenches. We thought that digging the trenches this way would look more stylish, sir. That's quite possibly the most idiotic thing I've heard all week. I don't even want to know why you buried our voxcaster. Who was the officer in charge of overseeing the trench digging? You, sir. Don't you remember? You came, yelled at us to dig the trenches, and then left muttering about fine wine. That would be me, sir. It does look more fashionable though, doesn't it? I thought maybe a pentagon for a while but then, it's just not the same, sir. I, wa, ma, you're meant to be one of the intelligent ones. Sir, defense to all sides sir. We only need to defend on one side. That's the entire point of this engagement. The enemy is in front of us. The idea is that we go over the top in a straight line. A bunch of you die, and it all looks very heroic. Yes, and I wouldn't have to drown my sorrows if I wasn't attached to a penal regiment made up of the universe's dumbest criminals. You people made me like this. With all due disrespect, sir, the marshal is an asshole. You're dickwood and I've had enough of this bullshit. My boots are wet. My flak armor should have been replaced four weeks ago. My last gun doesn't even scratch those Xenos beasts we're fighting. My whole platoon was killed in a mass charge against a fortified enemy gun line that you ordered and I haven't had a decent ration of coffee in two years. So fuck you and fuck the emperor, right lads? <laughs> Permission to burn the body, commissar? Permission granted. Just don't fire your flamer into the wind. Yes sir. You don't really think we're dumb, do you sir? Lemming, your bayonet is cutting into your shoulder. Oh, that sir. It's a new way of holding my gun. I think it's going to be revolutionary. Twice the effectiveness, I'm telling you. What? So you're stabbing something all the time? By the emperor, Lemming. Even when you're trying to kill yourself you're useless. Useless sir? Hardly. This method of equipment handling has plenty of upsides. For example, the enemy will think you're already wounded, letting you take them by surprise. Plus, having the barrel pointing upwards means that you can fire if you fall over sir. Let's cut this short, lemming. I want to get to the mess hall before they run out of corned beef rations. Stop holding your rifle like that, or I'll perform a summary execution. But sir, HMPH, fine. But when my ingenious tactical design would have come in handy, don't come crying to me, lemming. You've got red on you. All a part of my plan to fool the filthy Xenos, sir. Ah, so it's not actually blood then, is it? Of course not sir, it's ketchup from the rations. Mixed in with a healthy dose of my blood of course. Have to make it as realistic as possible. And, at a guess, what's the ratio of blood to ketchup, private? Around about 53, sir. You should catheterize the wound, so it won't bleed. Lem just use the ignition on my flamer. Um, commissar, we haven't seen the bugs in weeks. Are you sure the marshal didn't have some of the local flora for lunch? Are you questioning the marshal's intelligence and culinary taste, private? Sir no sir, I have a fear of small creatures swimming up my pooper, sir. Understandable, given last Tuesday's events. I'm surprised the medic allowed you to come back so soon. Are we, are we not meant to be eating the tyrannids, sir? I'm asking for a, a friend in another regiment. They cook really nicely inside their armor. You just have to add some local herbs for the flavor. The phrase is suffer not the alien to live, ma. That doesn't mean you can slow roast them, I know. Ask one of the lads with a plasma what's it to rustle something up sometime. The superheated particles make it extra crispy. You have to admit the rations taste really shitty commissar. Eating a heretic would be a better experience. That was a great bonding moment, wasn't it? Oh, some Prometheum makes everything a great experience Sarge. What exactly was it that landed you in the penal regiment, Lin? I've a horrible feeling I know already. Oh sir, you couldn't possibly know. In fact, funny story that. You see, the hive block I come from had this really nasty vermin infestation and, well long story short, those kids won't be needing any hairbrushes ever again. Just make sure you don't eat any junior officers. Otherwise we might not have enough bodies to choke the enemy. Yes sir, of course not sir. Between us, the Xeno taste better anyway. 
Sir, I'm fairly confident we can take the enemy in close quarters combat. I killed one of the blue tyrannids three weeks ago with my hands. Blue T. Strange, I've not seen any blue tyrannids. There was also a murder committed in the Mordian trenches around three weeks ago. I'm sure it was a tyrannid. Really scary too. It had a gun, and it was saying things rather than screeching. I think they're trying to figure out how to infiltrate our ranks sir. Was this blue tyrannid perhaps offering you a pamphlet with a circle and a smaller circle in it? Because I've seen a few of those. Yes it. You see. Commissar. I am still one of the smart ones. Need I remind you of the time Carlson replaced all of our Laskan battery packs with solar panels when we fought on that hive world so as not to damage the environment anymore? Ugh. Please don't. I've no room for hippies in my regiment. If any of you wants to be a salad eating environmentalist, just remember that Tyranids are the environment. We are the Imperium. And we are going to kill this environment. Greetings friends. I am Capitan Alexander. Where is your commissar of being? Hatwood. Unfortunately, be me. Are you sure you want to be here? Vostroyan? Stupid spreads like heresy here. Oh thank the Emperor. They're sending space rust sorry. Vostroyans. As backup? They're probably here to clean up our mess, sir. We agreed that the 5 mile blast crater was no one's fault. Sorry about that sirs. Salutes. Greetings friend commissar. I hear you speaking of roasted tyrannids. Yes. Is favorite on Vostroya. Anyway, I am here to discuss tic tacs with you. Your regiment is to be giving us cover fire while we plant explosives. Yes. I believe so. We've synced watches and we're just waiting for your lads to go up over the top. Don't worry, Vostroyan. We'll lay down a wall of death, probably for both you and the Tyranids. So I know this is very short compared to what you guys are used to, but think of it as more as just a basic primer to get you introduced to the penal regiment. Um, they're done by the same guys that do the cold shoulder, and they're looking to try and get more people involved in them. They're very active, so they are. They post 4pm every Sunday, I believe. I try and, like, you know, get there whenever I can to watch. I'm, and they've been trying to get me to join in with them, but I'm not a great writer. But I'm going to give it a good fire attempt and get joined in with them. Um, you should definitely check out the Discord. Um, their Discord was in the corner there. I'm sure you've seen it by now. Also, it'll be in the description down below. So definitely check them out. Worth a go. Um, great fellas. I enjoy them. If you haven't already, check out my Redbubble portfolio. You might just find something you like. This! not okay. This needs to stop now. This is cancer. This, this is so much cancer that I can feel the tumors growing on my back. And it's weighing down heavy on me and it's not okay. Can you help a nigga out and just stop this? Please?